welcome to my podcast. This is a podcast where I'll be teaching you all the systems and strategies you need in creating your visibility, so you can turn your passion for coaching into a profitable business. I'm your host Michelle Quay. I am a visibility coach, content and email marketing strategist, international speaker, and author, as well as the founder of Elevate Life Coaching. That just say that I know a few things about overcoming seemingly impossible obstacles in life and in business. I'm on a mission to be the champion that helps you to get to the top of your mountain one courageous step at a time. Welcome to the show. Hey, have you ever been to those places where people tell you that don't worry, everything is figure outable? Right, it's like you know you are stuck trying to figure out something, but like there's that voice in the back of your mind thinking, "Oh, don't worry, everything will be figure outable." Well, to some extent, it is true that everything is figure outable when we set our mind to it, when we set our determination, perseverance. We definitely have that moment of everything is figure outable. If we put our mind and energies behind it, no matter what challenges that we have, we can just figure it out because that's what we do in life. We keep figuring things out, whether it's on your own or with the help of someone. We will get to the place where we want to be eventually, however that long that may take. Well, I don't know about you, but sometimes things are not figure outable. Things actually require for some knowledge. These are where your knowledge base、uh, information comes in. Why do we keep searching for answers? Why do we go on Google, keep searching for、uh, the things and that that would actually help us to figure things out? Because not everything are figure outable. So what do you do? <laughs> and this is something that I've been experiencing a lot because I myself, you know, I, I, those of you who's been following my podcast for a while, you know that I had a, I have a story of overcoming adversity story where I'm physically disabled, and there I was. I need to figure out. Something that would move my life forward, but I didn't know what it was. I, I've never gone to the gym, didn't know how to use a machine. So there was a lot of things I had to figure out. And there's no denying that when you set your mind to it, when you sign your determination to it, you will figure out eventually. But we don't have years and years of figuring things out. So this is where your mentor, your guide, your coach. Comes in very handy, and they are your teachers. Every person that we meet on this journey become our teacher in helping us figure things out. So a lot of time I hear coaches, oh, you know, there's a、uh, free classes, there's a live webinar. Let me just go to those, and I will just figure it out. Or perhaps you're someone who's sitting there and you've been eyeing on a program, or you've been watching and some and following someone and wondering like how the heck did they do it? Maybe if I just consume more of their content, follow them closely, watching them closely of how they do it, I myself will figure out things along the way, which. I have no doubt you'll be able to do that. You will be able to figure out all these system roadmap blueprint, whatever what you want to call it, to set up the success in your business on your own. But I'm talking about those moments where you need the itty bitty, like the little tiny details of how they're talking to their audience, how they're connecting with their audience, how many emails, and all the back end work that you. Do not see because you're still in that space of trying to figure it out by consuming these little pieces that you、uh, you're watching, you're seeing, and I can I can tell you from my personal experience, I follow a lot of successful coaches. I follow Marie Folio. I follow Emmy Porterfield. I follow a lot of these amazingly successful coaches. And I watch them how they do things. I even signed up to their program. I watch them how they do things, and I can tell you that when you are out there on your own, trying to watch everything and trying to put the pieces of puzzle together for your own 
coaching business, not everything are figure outable. And this is why when there's an offer, it doesn't have to be mine, but when there is an offer that you've been following, if there's one person that you've been following for a very, very long time, and suddenly this person is offering you a solution by joining their program. I want you to really think about all the years that you've been following them and how useful, how do you connect to them? If you keep following someone, that that would tell me something about like you actually believe in what they do. So sign up to their program because not everything are figure outable. It's completely different when you have a a uh, the whole big picture of the puzzle versus you trying to take a piece here, take a piece there. And this is where that patchwork comes in, right? You take a pieces of everybody else's work and you patch it together. It, it, I'm, I'm sure it's going to turn out to be a beautiful art at the end, but all these pieces putting together, Unless you're a creative artist, I I suspect that you don't want to create a patchwork. You want a beautiful art that will last forever on your wall. So what is the message here? (laughs) My message to you today in this episode is that as you're consuming all these informations and free webinar, live training, no matter who you follow, I want you to really think about what am I getting out of this? And is what I'm doing something that is figure outable? And is this going to take me years in order to figure out the things I want the answers right now? And if your answer is, I don't want to spend years trying to figure this out and trying to put all these puzzles together, then I want you to think about who you've been following for a long time and that their program is something that would be of use to you. Hope that helped, and we'll see you in the next episode. Hey, beautiful. Thanks for listening. If you enjoyed this podcast and found value from this episode, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button on your favorite podcast platform and leave me a rating and review. One thing I was struggling in my early years in business was finding the right people to connect with. It feels like I was on this entrepreneur journey on my own. And sometimes we all just need friends who can share our dreams and hopes. Someone who can relate to what we're going through as we grow our business together. If you are a woman coach who is ready to grow your coaching business and looking for strategies to get seen, get heard, and get hired, I want to invite you to come and find me in our community on Facebook at Get Clients with Storytelling. This is a community of women coaches who want to grow a coaching business by creating engaging, visible, and authentic content with storytelling for their business to get more leads and attract more clients. I will see you at our next tea party.